What up, what up? I was eating a cracker at a bad time. Finish. My cracker! Oh my god, this is the first stream in like a week where I remembered to turn chat delay off. Can you believe it? It's- I'm, I've like- I'm, I'm back to not being used to it. I saw people immediately respond and I was like, whoa, god. That's something that I will never, ever understand about YouTube, is that they have the power to, to eliminate chat delay. Like, they have the ability. The only drawback is that you can't stream in 4K, which is like, I'll live. I don't need 4K. Why not make that the default? If people want to stream in 4K and have a full minute of chat delay, they should be the one to change a setting. Because for whatever reason, the default is like, chat is delayed by a minute. 
and you have to go through the settings and hit a button for it to be like, okay, now you can interact with your community in real time. I don't know why that's not the default, but whatever. Um, howdy team. Let's, uh, let's turn off the backing track here. As relaxing as the, those, those tunes are, uh, let's cut them and, and switch over to the switch. So switchies, let me, um, drink some water really fast. Okay. Tears of the kingdom. Let's get to it. Uh, last time, we we got a lot done. Last time we did, we did the whole like desert quest, like from start to finish, like from not even being there to finishing the dungeon. So that's three. That's three down. So I guess today we can we can slow her down a little bit. Yeah, because last week was just all about lore, all about the lore, all about the progress. Today let's make it all about the vibes, all about the fun times, all about the Boy Scouts, all about the camping, all about the West Virginia camping. My friend's camping in West Virginia to see the meteor shower. That is soon to come. Mike is still quiet. Uh, I'm going to objectively disagree on that one because on my end, my levels are uh, completely normal. Right in, the, right in the go zone for OBS. So I think that might be on your end. Ah. Here we are. Okay, so we dealt with your your uh, bug problem or whatever, and sand problem. Now that the city is populated again, well, I guess it's wow they really fixed it up. Lickety split. Let's take a look around and see if we want to buy anything. Okay. Oh, uh, we got oh my god, bomb flowers for sale. No, we gotta save our cash. I'm like only gonna buy stuff if it's clothes. Ooh, fresh meats. That's another thing we should do. We should do some cooking. Um, if I remember correctly, yeah, not much in the way of food. In fact, not anything in the way of food. So we're going to cook um, some ingredients. Cool. We haven't done a very good job of finding ingredients. We haven't been foraging as much as we did in the first game. I'm disallowed, apparently, from going that way. Let's see. Where would a fella find a cooking pot around these parts? That's my question. Oh my god, glad we did that. Apple. Also helpful. That's a rock. Okay. These pots are what it's all about. Cooking pot? Pot. Um, hello. Oh, here we go. Just need a little bit of fire. Uh, do I have any fire weaponry? There we go. Bingo. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. I don't want to burn down. This place looks very arid. Wow. 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 Okay. Yeah, let's make some weapons. Because goddamn. Um, let's see. We'll, we'll do some Gibdo Bone stuff. Apparently, these have a lot of attack power, and we have hella Gibdo Bones. So, sure. That does 80... Nope, 90 damage. Very good. Okay, we're just going to do that for literally everything. How does that sound? This one... Uh, oh, I forgot about our freaking Mirror Shield, dude. Uh, this one has strong... Like, is stronger with the Zonai devices, but... We just need attack power at the moment, so we're not going to use that. There you go. Dude, the Gibdo bones are no joke. They're single use. Oh. I was so confused. I was like, man, that's crazy. Okay, in that case, we're going to not do that. Um, I thought it was too good to be true. Then we'll, we'll do this one. I'm sure all these are going to be used for uh, upgrading armor, and I'm screwing myself by making cool weapons out of all of them, but I don't know, man. I'm loving the cool weaponry. Okay. Let's cook some gudge. Um, let's just make some apple tastiness, like a bunch of those. I think that'll be good for a good five heart heal. There you go. Never touched any Zelda games. Touch one, dude. You'll love it. 
You'll love what you feel. That's gross. I'm sorry. Trying to get my brother to try Persona. That's like one of, if not Sean's favorite game. I've never played it. Apples and berries. There you go. Oops. Yeah, I'm just going to keep going silly with this. Berries and, and maters. Seven. Holy shit. Okay. We got some new new. We'll do three new news and uh, a couple palm fruits, I suppose. Something a little tropical. This is good. This is good stuff we're doing here. Okay, what uh, we got some nuts, some meat. Let's make a. Let's make something a little more refined. Let's go meat. Chickalo tree nuts, a spice. Yeah, we'll, we'll put some spice on there. Uh, some herbs. So that that's a good piece of meat right there. Do we have any salt? Yeah. Okay, so we've already made just like a tasty dish. And then do we have any like rice or something to put on the side? I'm really thinking like a chef here. Maybe just, maybe some mushrooms. Couldn't hurt, right? Put a mushroom there as well. That, that looks tasty, right? Salt curled meat. Ummy. What if we just put a bunch of mushrooms in a pot? Sure. I mean, yeah. Dude, cooking is easy. Cooking is so simple. Uh, what, like, buffs would we actually use? This kind of stuff I, I'd like to save because I feel like it's going to be used for upgrading clothing. I usually only like to cook with stuff that's like... And mushroom. You dig? Two and a half! Bullshit. I'm calling bull hockey. Three and a half. Now we're talking. <laughs> okay. I need more juice. Mars is here. Hi, Mars. Ooh, stamina. Pop a like. Wow. That's good. We'll make some lesser versions of that if I only need to restore a little bit of, a little bit of stamina. There you go. I found I'm allergic to bananas. I'm so sad. That is tragic, dude. I love a banana. I love a banana. Super convenient. Not like my favorite fruit. Favorite fruit's got to be apple, but um, love a banana because of how convenient it is. And it just like makes me feel good eating it because they're very good for you. Okay. Um, let's just put this palm fruit in a pot. Yeah, fair, honestly. I thought it would be way worse. Okay, that's probably good, right? Yeah, okay, we're stocked now. Amazing. La, 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 la. No clothes, to, ah, no clothes to buy. Did we forget to buy some of the secret club clothes? Where's the secret club? <laughs> Sit here. Secret. Is that something sparkle? Huh. Get absolutely ransacked. Okay. Um. Oh. Thank you. Uh. Hello. Secret club. Oh, it's. It's. I think it's probably over here. Never mind. Let's just keep running in circles until we see it. Here we go. I remember the password. Oh, never mind. Oh, it's so like... Whoa, it's very smoky in here. Is that why it's a secret club? What are, what are we smoking? This is not well ventilated enough. Okay, we have those, I think. The desert... Vo outfits... Yeah, we've got the whole outfit. Um, the boots c could be so helpful. I just do not have the cash. Okay. Then we're going to bounce. Um, let's go elsewhere. We marked this spot with red, and I'm really freaking clueless. Bye, Mars. I'm really freaking clueless why we did that. Um... But I need to know. So we're gonna do we're gonna check it out. <laughs> Wait.
my dog is sprawled out across the floor asleep and his face is like crunched up against a bag and it does not look comfortable but he's asleep so wonder why he has joint problems in breed is he he's a Welsh Springer Spaniel Rebella Wetland Skyview Tower isn't that one of the diseases you get at the MMR shot to protect yourself against it's like measles mumps and rubella something like that let me get oops let me get the whole fit on now we're flying now it is really like for tonight when's your next minecraft stream we do those on wednesdays so it'll be next wednesday Kaka. Whoa. The skydiving mobility fit is like my favorite. Oh, I left Gerudo Town. Hi. Now I have three friends. There's a Korok. Okay. Yippee. But yeah, that's gonna be a really fun. He plays Minecraft. That's the catch. Usually, no. I've never beaten it before. So, Matthew knows a lot about Minecraft, and I really don't. So, we're starting a world, and we're gonna play it every Wednesday until we beat it. So, we did our first stream on Wednesday. It was very fun. We just kind of had a chill time. I died twice, and then we made a house. It was a good time. Uh, why the hell did I mark this, dude? Well... It's a mystery. You're good, Tulin. At ease. Uh, let's check out what's what this thing is. Because I am quite curious. You're good, dude. You can stop. Okay, cool. Oh, a, a cow or whatever. A bull. Why did I say cow? Okay. What's the... What's the gist? Some splash fruit? Sure. Whoa. Oh, thing fell. We could ride that puppy for miles. Let's see. Yippee! How's the weather in Virginia? Nice. Very humid. But not nearly as hot as... A lot of places in the U.S. It's kind of sitting around like mid to high 80s during the day. And then it'll get down to like mid to high 70s during the... Well, shit. Mid to high 70s. Trying... Oh, I, let's go to the Geoglyph. And then we'll go to the Shrine. Uh, and then it'll get down to like mid to high 70s during the night. It's very wet, though. It's very wet. I will say, I went to Texas. Um... And obviously, it's way hotter there. The week I went, it was like in the 100s, peaking at like 110 every single day I was there. Which obviously, my body is not equipped to handle. But, what I didn't expect is comfort-wise, I actually wasn't much more uncomfortable than I am outside in Virginia. Because it's so much less humid there. That like... I, and I know people always make fun of the like, it's a dry heat thing. But it's definitely true it is a real phenomenon of like it was so hot outside it was a dry enough heat that i just like felt hot but like in virginia it's only in like the it's like 85 or something but the second you step out of your house your skin is wet like you feel like you got out of a pool and i'm always holding like my little water cup and it like fogs over and my sunglasses fog so i can't see the second i step out of my house very wet 
Very damp. Okay, I need to find the little puddle. Is that it? I don't think so. That's just like some leaves. There's a little divot over there. Well, I need to know. Maybe there's some surprise under these leaves. in a village, but I do not see any village stuffs. It's Korok, probably. Nice. A little seashell on the ground. Amazing. Yeah. Let's go to the other one. Hello? Oh. There's a little fire fruit tree over there. Where's the village part of Lurland Village? I'm not seeing a lot of village. Here we go. All right, we made it. Waffles or pancakes? I like pancakes more by a lot. Ta-da! <laughs> it's the tears of the kingdom. Gonna drink some water. All right, Zelda. We are alone as you requested. What was it you wanted to discuss Yummy. with me in private? <laughs> you are far too trusting. Ha! -ha. <laughs> oh my! I'm surprised Owned. to hear you say such a thing. That is quite out of character for the Zelda I know. But then you. Are a puppet of Ganondorf. It's true. Did you really think we hadn't realized your deceit? Damn, that was clean. That was cold. I called it as well. Just want to say. <laughs> Who is it actually? Is it? I hope it's a little snail. Oh, it was nothing. Okay. Whoops. Oh my god, it was a double trick. Sonya is so pretty. Oh, never mind. <laughs> you got double tricked, son. That face is wild, dude. What the hell kind of face is that? I'm not scared of you, dude. That face sucked. Look at my dumbass mask. Whoa! Boop. New memory achieved. Okay, so that I was that's my figure when they said Zelda was releasing monsters everywhere. I was like, it's probably Ganon. Tee hee hee. Anyway, where is the shrine that I saw? Blood Moon. Pretty. Um Okay. Nope, it's a shadow. It's a rock with a shadow on it. Uh where's the village, dude? They said blah 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 village. And I see approximately zero. It's over here. Oh, it's a little dock. Cute. Am I, am I even pointed at it? Nope. 
I don't know. There we go. <laughs> oh, is it taken over by the goblins and we have to free it or whatever? Okay. You douche. Present. No fair, dude. He's in the goddamn rock. Lemons. Let's be away. And there's the shrine. I don't know why I said it like that. That was stupid. And there's the shrine. I'm done talking for the day. <gasps> Do y'all ever have that happen? Where you, like, become acutely aware that, that the way you just said something sounds really stupid? I experience that every day. Or sometimes I'll say something. And I'll be like, why the hell did you say it like that, you freak? And I see the shrine! What a freaking... What a weird idiot. Kaka! Uh-oh. Uh-oh! It's red as shit! Okay, can I... Are there pri... Oh, are there, are there prizes? Whoa, you guys are weird and, and mean. How have you not seen me? It's monster forces. You guys are literally everywhere and you're lagging my game. I'm gonna get off this hill because I think the plants are lagging my game. Monster force. How many monster forces? Okay, time out. Whoops, I didn't mean like that much of a timeout. Time out. Let's uh let's go put on our put on our bad bitch clothes. I guess we'll do boom, boom. And you're messing with the wrong guy because I've got simmered fruits. Ow. Uh. Okay, this guy sucks. I'm going for you first. Okay. I want your... Nice, thank you. Wait, I want your prizes. Nice. Oh, that's going to make a cool weapon. I saw you. There you go. I need more sensitivity on my joystick. La 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 la. Okay, there are more monster. God, there are a lot of monster forces, dude. We're not even close. Okay, my weapon's about to break. Meats. Roasted porgies. Okay, what, who are we going to electrocute? <laughs> that ability is really fun. I'm sorry for shitting on it. I just thought it would be inconvenient to use. To be fair, I did use it only by accident. Oh, I thought you would just do two and then scream at me like you usually do. But instead you got all cute or whatever. Okay, this is only going to have one hit in it. Wow! Time out, please. Okay. You're being mean. Okay, I need to fuse a new weapon stat. I guess we can get one hit with this. There we go. Okay, let's take five. Let's make some weapons. There we go. 60 and it's and it's permanent. That's huge. Um, whoa, game. Oh, now my capture's like, okay, hold on. Please pause while I fix my capture. I'll be quick. Never fear, gamer beer. Don't give any allergies. <laughs> it's a good time to ask that. No, at least not that I know of. Uh, I have a theory that I might have a very minor intolerance to peanuts because I've lately noticed a pattern where every time I eat peanuts or peanut butter, I feel really sick. But that might just be something stupid because I feel like if I had an actual intolerance, it would be more than just feeling yucky. I'd like have a th my throat close. Maybe it's just like a very minor intolerance. There you go. 32. Nothing crazy, but it'll get the job done.
Uh, I was about to say, there are more, aren't there? Oh, this place is completely taken over by bad bitches. Hi. Oh, wait, hold on. Can you do... Where did you go? Don't run into battle. I need you. I wanted to do the lightning strike. I don't want it. Rah! I want these. Thanks. Oh. Ay! I'm staying light on my feet. Get up, dog. Get up. An opening. There you go. Okay. Never turn your back. Glad I cooked all that food, dude. I'm less glad that we're gonna go through like flypaper. Okay, where are meanies? Dude, they're so far away. Suck my balls! Wow, that one shot him? Damn, okay. Clean. Oh, you burned it down, you assholes. We. Let's be sneaky. Oh, he got it off. Time out. You know what we need? You can't see me. You literally can't. You know what we need? We need to make a new party bot. How do we make the first party bot? It was a homing cart. Um... This, and then what do we want to shoot them with? We got wheels. We can put a battery on it. Uh, beam emitter. Yeah. Party bot time. Okay. Now. There we go. And then... got a homing cart. Which side is the side that homes? Probably the face, right? I guess it doesn't matter. Because this thing just kind of faces wherever it finds an enemy. So it doesn't matter at all. Okay, and then beam emitter in line with the face. Okay, and then a battery. We technically put this one backwards. I don't think it matters. Let's fix it. Just in case. Oh, I didn't think it was going to have to maybe redo everything. What the frick, dude? These guys aren't going to know what hit them. Alrighty, B-words. Who wants to be the first creature subjected to Party Bot 2.0? Where did they all go? There they are. Party bot. Destroy. It said at great range with the light. So let's, let me try just. Oh my god. Party bot. Holy shit, party bot. Oh my god, and now we fly in. Oh, party bot can friendly fire. That's okay. Look at him, dude. Yeah, dude, torch him. Frickin' torch him. Yeah! Okay, party bot power down. Oh my god, that was awesome. Good job, party bot. Okay, now recharge, now go. Don't hurt me. Ow! Party bot. Oh, he fought right through my... Good job, party bot. Power down. Brilliant! Dude, party bot rules. Okay, let's drop some weapons we don't want. That was awesome. Okay. Uh, what the hell are we doing with this, dude? 
when we have stone axe. Okay. Yeah, give me the sword. Thank you very much. Prizes. That was not as many prizes as I expected. Okay, we're halfway through the monster forces. Uh, what's in here? Wait. Cool. Oh, there's people in there. I should cover up, then they find me. I just as I can. Help, help, help. I know the solution. Okay. Oh, and it's extra durable. This weapon's awesome, dude. All right, party bot. Uh, we need to find more baddies. We've done half of it, so there's clearly plenty more. What is that shield? It's my mirror shield, dude. It's a mirror. It's super awesome. Okay. Um. Down here, maybe? No. Up? Huh. Party bot, I'm confused. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, they're in the ship. They're in the ship. The other enemies are in the ship. Let's go to the ship. Oh, we didn't miss that many. Oh, you stupid bastards. Okay. Can freaking whatever her name is come up here so I can do a lightning shot? Riju. Riju, hello. No. Looks like I'll have to take... Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Looks like I'll have to take matters into my own hands. One of them drowned. Good start. Dude, they just watched me become an X-Man in the air. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> Damn straight. Stop pushing the box. <laughs> Got him. There it is. That's what we like. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? He, she stopped. He left. Yeah, probably for the best. I'm gonna go to the crow's nest. Okay. Okay. I reflected it with my mirror shield. Where are the other monster forces? The big kahuna guy just straight up bounced. I don't know whither, because we didn't kill him for sure. He just like left. Okay, well, let's get our spoils. Where'd he go? Oh, really? You're not going to let me? Okay, for sure, man. Oh, my God. Never mind. He drowned. <laughs> he drowned off camera. 
Poor dude, I guess they can't swim. Okay. Uh, there's still a few more. Maybe in there? The poor sucker drowned. Okay, well, let me get a palm fruit. Did a little off camera drowning. Let's check in here. Dude, come on. You know you want to let me in. Never had an enemy climb before? Okay, there's nothing in here. Um, hello? There's still like two or three people. Oh, he woke up. Good morning, sweetie. You look so tired. Please just go back to sleep. Um, cha-cha-cha. Ra cha cha cha. Ratta ratta ratta. Where the frick, dude? Oh, maybe in that well. Oh, dude, totally. It has its own little title card. Bitch. Okay, I don't know. I was about to say, I don't know how much longer this thing's gonna last. Let's light on fire. Okay, uh. Move on. There's still another monster. Ooh, yummy. What the F word? There's still one more. Hello? Okay. There's one monster somewhere. <laughs> somewhere. Do any of my abilities maybe would highlight a person? Maybe if I did like... Nah. Because I was thinking like Ultra Hand kind of highlights important objects. I was wondering if maybe I could use something to highlight a person. What is this? It's just a rock. Um... We just need to find one dude. We can do it. Why is he all alone? I feel kind of bad for that one. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's going to break immediately. Wow. That was all it took. All right. Complete. I've solved world hunger. Hmm? Numar. Consider yourself saved. Roselle, everyone. It's safe to come back now. I am your king now. Those horrible monsters are... They're all gone. Every last one of them. So everything from the house where I was hiding. Did you? This lone warrior type showed up out of nowhere and took out every monster in the village all by himself. Whoa. I can hardly believe it. You look like a strong breeze could blow you... Oh my god, what a dick, Bolson. You look like a strong breeze could blow you over, but you're solid as stone. Extraordinary. That is what you are. Thanks, man. Hi, Roselle. So relieved that everyone in the village escaped uninjured. How? Still, it was awful. All we could do was watch as the monsters overran our home. If you hadn't come, this village might have been ruined beyond repair. We all owe you great debt. Thank you very much. Rad. Good news is not all the houses have been destroyed. If we work together, I'm sure we can rebuild. Yay, Balson's going to do it. His act of chivalry is a little fire under me. Ready to get to work, baby. Bolson, you're only a visitor, and yet, what can I say but thank you? Oh. Cool. I'm sorry, but I don't have anything I can give you as a reward. Then why the hell did I do all that, Roselle? Once the village is rebuilt, we'll be sure to show you just how warm our hospitality can be. Oh. Eventually. <sighs> can I help accelerate this rebuilding process, perhaps? Now the pirates are gone, even the air itself feels clean again. Can't thank you enough. Mm -hmm. You fought those pirates. It was incredible, all inspiring. <laughs> pirates may be gone. Dang. Can I help? Can I help? Do something about the state of the village or no one will return home. Oh my god, can this be like a Roblox tycoon, please? Oh. I might not look it, but I know a thing or two about construction. Okay. I don't know what you mean by might not look at. You look mighty capable. 
Pay my debts. It's kind of my thing. So it has charm. Can't wait to restore the restaurant and the lucky treasure shop to their former glory. Hmm, materials might be an issue though. See, I'm gonna need rather large oh a rather large amount of logs and Hylian rice. Logs have to come from somewhere else. How can I help? What did you say? Appreciate the offer, but you've already done so much. Well, I want you to give me rewards. Oh. Mm -hmm. We're pals. We're pals. We're pals. Mmm. Mm, 15 logs. One's from palm... Oh, I don't need one's from palm trees. Get those logs from other trees. 20 bundles of rice. Easily. Easily. How the hell do I keep a log? That's my question. Because I can keep little bundles of wood. Do I have to, like, cut them down and then drag them over here with Ultra Hand or some shit? I don't have a fast travel point. Well, there's a, isn't there a shrine somewhere nearby? Yeah, let's go grab that shrine. So if we gather enough rice and logs, we can easily... Oh, well, here's some logs. Dude, I, I got you some logs right here. Whoops. Okay, whoops. Let me stick them together. Dude, you could have easily done this yourself. Okay, I'll be back for you. Let's do the shrine. Uppies. We saved the world or whatever. What did he use? I need mean, 15 logs, was it? I'll just cut down all the trees outside this <laughs> shrine and bunch them up together with my ultra hand. Sifumim Shrine. The last M looks like a typo. Can't really explain why. Amazing! What a beautiful world we live in. Oh, I was about to say I'm a Nike. This shrine imprisons and purifies the ancient evil. Okay. Outside of... Yeah, I can figure it out. Proving grounds. Flow! Oh, I've got flow. Check me out. Uh. Harry Potter, Larry Totter. I thought I bought her, but I forgot her. Can I have a bow or something? They're just gonna keep shooting me. Surprise. I'd like your bow, please. Ow. Where do my things go? I need that. It's like a lazy wibble. Okay. Now I have a bow. It should make things much easier. No. Eh. Okay. <laughs> oh, he drowned. Come on. Okay. Oh, well, shit. Dude, that guy, I don't know how we're going to kill you. I guess we're going to have to just do everyone around him and hope I can gear up enough to deal with that. Dude, is way too strong for the equipment I had at that point. Oh, boy. 
Okay. This one might be really, really hard. I know. Sneak strike. I mean, my weapon had two attacks, so the sneak strike still would have done almost none of his health. I think we just need to be more geared up for that. Damn it, I tried to grab it before it fell in it. And that's why. Okay, let's hang back. Well, I should get on the raft. We've got this, so let's, um. I can't take that out. Oh, maybe I was too close to the. There you go. Okay, um. There we go. Okay, we got seven now. That's pretty good. Missed. How many arrows? Did he drop five arrows? Oh, I must have missed him. Okay, I'm trying to get him to keep shooting at me. Oh, that's helpful. Dude. Little low on arrows. Okay, we're not gonna go up top. We cannot handle that yet. We're gonna have to go around. Let's go to the back. Yeah, let's take care of this guy. He probably has some arrows on him. It's fun, I like this. Oh, oh, it's just the barrels. No, oh, it's because he's right there. Hi. Okay. I need your stuff. Huge. Okay, we got some arrows. That should be an even stronger thing. Yeah. Okay, we got a 10 damage spear. That's very handy. All right. This is the worst part. Oops. Okay. Um. Gonna be very careful. And making literally no noise. water. Damn it. Okay. I don't really know what I was supposed to do about all that, but sure. Just trying to knock him into the water. Boy, I thought I was doing good that time. That guy in the middle is like unbeatable. I think I, I, I guess I just have to do them last. I don't want to, though. It takes so much longer. Can you hurry, please? Okay. We're going to go same route. Okay, Bo. Damn it. Oh, my God. That was so unfair. Okay, um, now, let's make our weapon. Okay, now I hide. are so annoying. Okay. I'll drown him. Loverly. Yeah, 
Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, let's do this. I got the googers in the back. Scoop up it'll bat. Can I knock you far enough back to fall in the Oh, his head popped up at the exact wrong time. Okay. I need your stuff like really bad. There we go. Okay, we got lots of lemons as well. So if we're low on health, which we are right now, it's just like, we could use these to fuse to our arrows. Oh, they only heal a quarter. Yeah, we should just use them with arrows then. Um, oh wait, let's actually, let's just break our old weapon because we're gonna go for just maximum damage. Oh, I forgot you have to freaking. Here you go, 12 rather than 10. We're not gonna go for big boy yet. I actually would like to go back around the other way because I wanna go to that other side. This is stupid, it's just the recall is gonna run out and then we're gonna just go right back to going the wrong way. Okay, I need to get around you so if I hit you, you go into the water. Okay, you freaking dick. Oh wait, prizes. I want those, I can get those later. Good tomorrow. Okay. I'd like your goodies. You got a bow. Shoulder construct two. Ice fruit. Okay, we can do ice arrows, we can do shock arrows now. We can do both of them. Okay, if we go up this way, you'll see us. You can't see me. No way, you can. I am not visible from where you are! Let's just go up the ladder. Oh my god. Okay. He's looking around. We were doing that last time. Last time you were just looking forward. Okay, you can't see me. Let's let's do a break down here. We can do ice arrows. We're gonna try a sneak strike again. We can do it this time. Do not. Do not. Do not. Yee! Oh my god! <laughs> Tried to get cute. God damn it. I thought they wanted me to use that. I should have just ignored it. I got scared. <laughs> okay. Fifth times, fourth times a charm or whatever. Whatever iteration this is. This one's rad. I love it. Okay. Wooden stick. I gotta wait for this guy to come, come to town. We're close. We're very close. It's just that, that guy up there is super tough. That, that very topmost fellow. I think that time I was geared up. I just didn't do a good job. Eh, eh, eh. Yeah. Okay, let me get all the. They're gonna shoot me while I'm in the water. That's fine. I can take it. Okay. Do not. Do not. Well, it's just gonna. Yeah. Whatever. Okay. I'm going way more impatient this time. We'll see what the result is. Okay. That's not what I meant. I just need your stuff. Dude, that is, that's literally the entire screen that that affects. Okay. 
Uh, now we're down to five hearts, so that's basically game over. But we're going to keep playing. <coughs> because I'm not a quitter. <coughs> Jesus. A couple of really strong sneezes. Oh no, my stick's going to break. Guess we're rocking a spear this time. I need to get better at the controls. Okay. Put him in the drink. Ah, I didn't get him in the head. No way that hits me. I'm just going to say that. You missed by eight miles, okay? I have two hearts. It's freaking over. Okay, well. Oh, my God. I got to swim through the fucking lazy river. Okay, uh, I need to eat. I'm, not, I'm realistically never going to use these to fuse to my arrows. Like, that's just not going to happen. Okay. Get your stuff. Oh, a club. I haven't found that yet. That's crucial. Okay. 30 thick stick. High durability. This is so crucial. Okay, and then we're gonna... Thanks for that, by the way. Okay, 15. Still almost no health is, is the issue. Um, it's this freaking whore on the top shelf. Jesus, dude. All right, we just gotta, we just gotta do our best. Do our sneak strike. I, I, now that we have the, now that we have the club weapon, we're gonna do extra knockback. So I feel like if we do a sneak strike and then just spam the swing button, we might be able to knock him far enough to go into the drink. Cause that's the key with these dudes. They don't like water. That is bullshit! And you know it's bullshit. Well, that's just kind of curtains, isn't it? Oh my god. I hit him! Whatever, dude! I hit him. I thought the second hit is supposed to knock him back. It played the you hit him sound effect, and then he just hit me. Jesus Christ. This thing is unreal. I feel like I can't beat this guy in the middle unless I go hitless the whole shrine, which I'm having a hard time doing, considering the shock arrows area of effect is your entire screen. I don't want the, sh I want the stick. I don't want the spear. I want the stick. Here I come. Hey, 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 hey. Do not. I'm trying to run away so they don't hit me with this shock arrow. Okay. Okay. Don't. Don't. Arrow. Okay, I've got my bow now. Where did I? He didn't drop any arrows that time. That's fine. We don't need them. We're just gonna ride, ride the lazy river to victory. Oh my god, dude, this is freaking. Okay. Get up, dude, get up. Okay, being in the water is like a death wish. Dude, I have no arrows. Yeah. I can't fight back. I actually can't fight back physically. I have no way of fighting back. I can shoot once. Yep, well, I missed the head, which means automatic loss. Oh, I'm stuck under the raft. Okay, there we go. All right, well, I have no arrows, so I'm not sure exactly what I meant to do. I guess that guy at the beginning just sometimes gives you arrows. Because when he doesn't, you're just kind of screwed, aren't you? Oops. Oh, I forgot to make a new weapon. I don't think I need to for this guy. I think I just need to knock him into the water. And I can really do that with any old thing. Stop falling into the water, Link. 
Jesus. He also didn't drop arrows. What is going on, dude? You, don't they usually give you little bundles of arrows? What the hell am I supposed to do? I have one arrow. And my freaking stick's about to break. This run sucks. I don't even know what I'm doing differently this time. I'm just like not receiving arrows. Okay, I've got a spear. Is that big kahuna? Okay, yeah, then we do not want to go there. Let's deal with this freaking whore. How did you not... How did you not see me until I was underneath you, dude? Oh, nice. Confused. The poor bastard. Give me arrows, dude. Please. Thank you. Don't hit me. There's our club. There's our ticket out of here. Okay, now. I think that means they're all dead except big boy. And maybe one more. You do not see me. That's bullshit. Going around the back. There's what there is another one. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and make our weapon. Oh. No. Okay. Let's eat all the food items we've amassed. Okay. And this is the best it's gonna get. I have to swim, because if I like walk, he'll notice me. I have enough stamina to get there. Okay. Yeah, sure. What the hell, dude? Come on. If I drown because of this, I'm going to be so pissed. It, Yeah, it's broken. I'm just going to have to go back to shore. Oh, my God. I swear if they make me drown because of that. Oh, thank Christ. Okay. Let's try again. I want him to see me, though. Anytime I'm out of water, there's a very high chance he will see me. jump at like the frame perfect time where it just sends you right back into the drink okay i last time he just like spotted me inexplicably so this time i guess we just hope he doesn't this is the most hearts we've ever had we might be able to live one attack please please merciful lord Give me in the water. Give me in the water. Boom! And we harvest. Oh my god. Now we just need to find the freaking last one. There he is. Balls. Boom! <laughs> that took way... That was embarrassing. I should have beaten that in like one or two tries. Okay. We did it. Christ, man. That was a really fun one. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, well, now I got a freaking... Okay. There's a spike hit ball. Oh, are you supposed to, like, sneak up here and then go, like... Well, I don't know. <laughs> Boom jams. What's my prize? I love it. Love a good weapon. Okay. Another shrine bested, which also gives us a quick warp back to Lorlin Village if we need it. 
Now I guess let's get to work looking for logs and rice and shit. Why do they need rice, dude? Just use like palm leaves or something. Ferns. I'm gonna eat this cookie. Yummy! Okay, let's cut down these trees. One. Thank God I still get a log. Okay. Lizard. Okay. Um. How'd I freaking know someone would bring up deforestation? I swear. You're all the most predictable people I've ever known. I bet I could say anything. And I bet my first guess as to what would come next in the chat would come true. I feel like y'all have like a, a six-sided die with six words on it. And anytime you're looking to chat, there go the lizards. You roll it. Every time. Deforestation. Arson. Tax evasion. Chaotic, unhinged, and wholesome. Are like the only six words y'all know how to say. I swear to God. Every freaking time I cut down a tree in any game, deforestation, or like anytime anything's on fire, even if it wasn't in my hands, people are like, oh my God, arson. I know everything you're going to say before you say it. Just so you know. I know. I always do. We got eight logs. Oh, my computer broke. I gotta fix it. Arson is a word that needs to be taken off the dictionary. We've had enough. Yeah. Arson definitely falls into the category for me of like... It's just used so often. It's not not funny anymore. I feel like I just there was like months at a time where every single video on TikTok was some streamer advertising himself on TikTok being like reasons why I should be your comfort streamer and it was just the same three jokes every time of them being like I love arson. It's like wow, you're so freaking different. And it was like that every day. Okay. I feel like everyone in a live chat wants to be the like, oh my God, so chaotic. We're so chaotic. It's like, not really. Eh. This is, this is the same point I was talking about before about how chaotic has become this generation's like XD random where like the ultimate goal in life was to be random now it's chaotic it's like that picture someone put on tumblr that went viral of like ah damn it there goes one of the logs of like the number of people who had a uh, tumblr like blog post that was like welcome to my fucked up mind it's like dude you freaking watch like Grey's Anatomy, okay. Logs, what's happening? Everything's on fire. Oh, is there a blood moon? Oh no. I'm so scared. Enough. We commit crimes on our streams. It's like, no you don't, you just spell words wrong and then laugh. 
and then talk about how chaotic you are. They're everywhere! Actually, that Blood Moon was super handy. But I need logs. Don't. Lizards. Dude, this is the, this is the spot. If you're looking for a lizard, like, do not make a listing on, like, Craigslist. Go to tree whatever. Leave me alone! You made me break a log! You guys are annoying. Don't make me break any more logs. I don't want to accidentally hit that log. My freaking... I've had enough. You're going to make me get out my stone axe. Four. Five. I need more water. Da 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 Okay. Uh seven. That's pretty good. Let's connect it to our other log bunch. And look, the other trees respond. Welcome to my twisted mind. And it's pictures of English TV men kissing on their Tumblr blog. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, here we go. Yeah, let's go. Whoops. Lizards. Stop pushing it, dude. You don't need to push it. I love that the lizards just... Damn it! But they just sit there and let you grab them with your big ugly mitts. One. How many logs is, is that? 16. That's more than we need. Done! I want the lady to put the frozen veggie on her head at the grocery store. Oh, that's true. Forgot about that. And they're like, so silly. Can't take you anywhere. Uh... Uh, uh, okay. Whoops. We gotta get down there safely. Okay, so I'll just do what that did. All right, now where is Benson or whatever the hell? I cut down so many trees for you, Benson. Does that mean we get to kiss now? What, what is happening? Oh, you're over there. I can see your fluorescent pink pants from miles away. All right, dude. 16 logs. Consider it done. Boom. Go ahead. Be sure to take good care of this. Trees. Thanks for getting those logs. Make 16 in our collection. Wait, look at that. What a haul. Thanks a lot, pal. You got enough logs to make the repairs. You need 20 bundles of Hylian rice. Uh, about the materials. Oh, shit. Buy it in Hateno Village. Uh-huh. Do we even have... Have we even found Hateno... We definitely haven't. We haven't found Hateno Village or Kakariko Village. What the hell are we even doing, then? Where even is Kakariko I don't remember. Okay. We need to find both of these places. Hateno, I guess, would be more ideal. I will say it's so funny when chat tries to be quirky random and then Therm calls us out. I've been doing this long enough. Head of goddamn steel. Uh. 
my god. Okay, we need to find whatever the hell. We need to find Kakariko Village. We need to find Ateno Village. Where the hell is that? I don't remember F F Ateno. <laughs> <coughs> I don't remember. We're gonna look it up. Ateno Village. Tears of the Kingdom. How to get to Hateno Village? Just give me the point on a map and then I'll find it. Found it. Okay. Right there. Okay. I can do that. It's like around here somewhere. right here. Boom! Seen new season of Heartstopper yet. I don't know what that is. What is Heartstopper? Is that like the new TV craze? Is it like the new Euphoria? Remember when you said something about feet and then went like, feet jokes aren't funny before anyone sent a single message because <laughs> I knew every time I make a joke where the crux, crux of the joke is that it's like something questionable about feet everyone immediately is like hey yo clip it uh clipped dude clip that I know what's coming it's a book and a show now hmm I've never heard of it it's a Netflix show based off a of comic it's really good Epic. Uh, man, we're not even... We haven't even explored this area at all. We have, like, no shrines here. We, have, we don't have a lot of shrines in general. Our shrines are very linear. It's like a big X. Okay. Uh, We'll go from here. It's about gay people. Ugh, then I don't want to watch. Get your gay out of my life. You're turning the kids gay with the rainbows in the classrooms. Burn them. Okay. I love that I can just say whatever I want because I feel like I've curated the right audience where no one would have a problem with that. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I don't have to worry about, like, oh, there's no one homophobic in here. Dude, I made Stardew Valley videos for, like, a year. I don't think I've ever seen a homophobic person in even the comments. Let alone the live chat. My pronouns are USA. My pronouns are kiss my ass. It's cold. And there's a shrine. Oh, there's a shrine. That's the Hatena Village Shrine. Okay, then we'll go there first. So pretty. Uh-oh. We're going to run out of stamina. Ooh, a little rice field. Or something field. I don't know. A field. Blue Heron pronounce. Boo. I don't understand the point of pronouns. So I'm gonna explain. Pronouns are like a grammatical classification of words, the same way that like a noun is, or an adjective, or a verb, or something like that. So pronouns are like placeholder nouns that you re use to refer to things instead of just saying it over and over again. So for instance, instead of just saying I ate an apple, the apple was good. I liked the apple. The apple was red. You could use it. You'd be like, it is red. I ate an apple, it was good. So it is a pronoun, because it refers back to the apple, so you don't have to say apple again. So there are just pronouns, there are also personal pronouns, which is what you use to refer to people. Some people prefer to be referred to as he and him and his and whatever. Some people, she and her and hers, and some people don't prefer either, prefer something else. So it's just whatever you like to be referred to as. 
That's why it always freaking kills me when I see tweets of someone being like, there are no pronouns in the Bible. It's like, dude, they're everywhere. <laughs> they are in every sentence, just about. Hate to tell you. Scoop it out. Who's ready to scoop the flip word out of this B word? Who's ready to goop the script word out of this chiz word? Well, I gotta figure out what the hell is going on. Is this a photo booth? Pittsburgh Pirates. Oh my god, dude. It's a little prize machine. Yes, please. How do I... Whatever the hell. Scoopty. Okay, this shield is annoying. <laughs> Scoopty. Okay, we gotta we gotta hold on. Let's actually think this through. We need to transfer electricity. So we need to leave one there anyway. And that'll power. Oh, it's going the wrong way. Okay, well, we'll recall it, so that's fine. Okay, so let's not power it yet, then. Oops. Thought we. Okay. That's fine. Um, is that going to reach far enough down to actually scoop it out? Let's add a couple more. They gave us five after all. I'll bring them both over at the same time. Yay! And then we'll scoop them all up. Oh, wait. Oh, I put it on the wrong side. <laughs> I understand now. Okay, we're going to have to do it on the other side. I'm an idiot. Okay. So we have one there. Do another one here. Okay. And then... Yep. We get these two. One. Uh, hello? Boink, the best YouTuber. Yeah, it's not really close, is it? Not much of a competition. Okay, uh, I need to, f let's see, we'll, we'll do like a, that, I can't, s I can't see, just guess, that's probably fine, okay, and then, oh, shit, okay, there we go, uh, oh, oh, oh whoops, that should do the trick okay now we we scoop it out just need to scoop one oh and it scooped like 50 grillion Scoop. Scoop the. Uh oh. They're all getting picked off. You're shitting me. Oh, wait. I should have 
been there to grab it. Okay. Oh, well. That's mean. Okay, well, let me... I can just... Hold on. I'll, let me... I'll, I'll fix this without turning it off. Really? Okay, hold on. There we go. Okay, we're gonna try again. It'll scoop, in theory. Well, shit. Okay. Um. Oh. Hey, Prog again. What if I just. I wanted to do the scoopies, but I could just do this, right? <laughs> I didn't have the patience. Okay. I made a scoop, it scooped. That's all that counts. Owned. Okay. What's gonna happen? All right, let's buy some rice. <laughs> I'm the hero of time. Oh, mushrooms. How cute. Okay. Uh, do any of you sell rice? What? Oh, couldn't a Kochi die shop? Your new customer, I think. I'm just dying around here. I I don't want the die clothes. I like them the way they are. I want these apples. Okay. Um, there's an armor store. You're speaking my language. What? We came all this way. Excuse me. Why? Is there like a mushroom convention? What the hell is going on? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, now can I go? Sorry to keep you waiting. Are you also tourists? Came to see my sisters. I mean, the new line of CC product. As long as it's just you, you're free to go to the shop. CC herself is in there right now, in fact. That thing you'll see is for sale. It's only an exhibition right now. What? What? Okay, I don't see anything, dude. CC, what gives? Except this weird-ass hat. No. Ah, another practically perfect masterpiece. It's an, it's an exemplar of the form from every angle. This is the sort of thing on which I've built my name and reputation. Whatever, shut up. I'll kick you. Uh -huh. Oh, pardon me. You an admirer here to meet the incomparable Cece? <sighs> I guess. I must say, you don't seem to show any sort of interest in fashion. Ooh. Well, I want armor. Welcome to Ventist Clothing, the only boutique in the world which carries the CC brand, if you weren't aware. No. Why's it going? 
every time she moves. You stand before the very woman who changed this fussy old village into the birthplace of nouveau fashion. As proof, I present you this. Aww. The CC hat. The newest and most magnificent work by yours truly, CC. Okay. Do you see that luxurious curve? Do you know my- Oh. Would you call it the pinnacle of perfection? I don't like it. This is so special that I dare not assign a price to it. It is not for sale. Do you have armor? Shall only part with it when I find someone truly worthy of owning it. Okay. On the most impressive, impressive fashionista in Hyrule's trendiest village is worthy of such a crown. Damn. What's all this about Hyrule's trendiest village? I don't remember approving any new slogans for Hateno. Ah, look who's here. What can I do for you, oh, oh esteemed Mayor Reed? Uh, Looks mad. I'm really sorry. I tried to stop him from coming in like you asked, but he wouldn't take no for an answer. Uh, Cece, you have got to quit littering the village with your weird art pieces. Maybe you don't realize, but plants need their sleep too. Those eyesores are so bright at night, they're keeping the veggies awake. It's a real problem for the crops. Tano's foundation is its produce. What are we going to do if it fails? Now, now, dear. There's no need to get so worked up. I think some of the people here actually like her art, you know. Wouldn't it be better to hear her out? Yeah, probably. Don't fall for her line of twaddle. She's got everyone in Hateno wrapped around her finger already. I don't really like either of these people. <laughs> I don't want to take a side on this issue because I'm not a huge fan of either side. I think CC should be free to... To express her art in whatever way she pleases, but also she's cocky as hell. And this dude's just a dick. Uh -huh. But also, if it is actually preventing crops from growing, that is a problem, but I doubt it is. Looking after the village, you say. Who do you suppose you have to thank for Hateno's rejuvenation? Mm. I d it didn't need rejuvenating. Hateno Village is a peaceful place for folks of quiet lives, and that's the way they like it. <laughs> do they? Then let us leave the matter to the people to decide. My avant-garde approach versus this mayor's quaint, bygone ways. Citizens will decide which outlook will drive the future of the village. By holding a mayoral election. Oh, damn. Sure, suits me. I'll win that pretty easy. Sophie, I delegate management of the mayoral election to you. What? Whoops. Come on, Clavia. I don't feel like sticking around here any longer. Time we headed back home. Welp. Okay. <laughs> Can I run as a third party? I feel like I'm very agreeable. I saved the village from monsters or whatever. I have this mirror mirror shield for reflecting light. Boing! What's happening? Oh, you again. Got a long to-do list in preparation for the mayoral election. The sooner I get started, the better. Hmm... The answer should go without saying, but you are, of course. I'm undecided. Uh -huh. Oh. If you haven't yet thrown in your lot with either candidate, then welcome to Team CC. Ooh. That settles that, I trust. Well, it's planned for all to see that I'm a shoe in for the next mayor. Oh. Or so one would think. Yet there are stragglers in this village still supporting Reed. They need a mental makeover. No. And so, I have a fabulous plan to give out mushrooms. I'm sorry. Reed supporters. Mushrooms are synonymous with the CC brand. Fungal fashion is the CC way. The mushrooms I give them will will paint them inside and out with fresh, vibrant CC brand colors. Oh. Although, Sophie and I must mind the shop. Where will we find someone we can trust to carry out this vital task? I'll do it. No. There's the magic words I was waiting for. You're a lifesaver. Now then, you'll be needing these. Cool. Oh. These mushrooms are for the village's Reed supporters. It's easy to recognize them by how unstylish they are. Uh, no. <sighs> You're fashionable. Yeah. You're fashionable. Eh, I should talk to you. You had an exclamation point. Uh. Yeah. She saddled me with so much work when she put me in charge of the mayoral election. Uh. Um, sir? I think I should apologize for dragging you into this mess I found myself in. But, since we're both involved now, would you give me a little advice? 
Sure! Ah! Should have expected that. The thing I need your advice on is my sister. It's about Cece. Lately, she's been sneaking off alone in the middle of the night. I don't think it's anything sinister, but the election is soon. I don't want any last minute surprises to hurt her chances. So I'd like you to tail my sister, find out where she's going and what she's up to, get back to me. Okay. Really got an earful about it, too. If you succeed in finding out what she's doing, I can reward you, of course. The only one I can ask for help. I don't want any of them. Help me out, please. <sighs> I suppose I'm really hungry. Okay, well, we'll tailor when it's nighttime. You're fashionable. God, everyone here has shit they need help with. Oh my god. What's the matter? You can tell me, weirdly handsome dude. Thanks. Look, you've been places. Sure, things are peaceful in the old village, but it's a jungle out there in the world. That's why I stick around here, checking out the scene. Making sure no strangers put the moves on Miss Ivy. Wait, I mean. So I make sure no strangers come in from inside and disturb the peace. Ivy? Huh? Forgot the miss. I always add the miss. Miss Ivy is the poster girl for the East Wind General Store. It's no problem if you want to talk to Miss Ivy. Just keep the naive. I just moved here. Won't somebody show me around? Act to a minimum. Not anyone could be as young, guyish, or fashionesque as me. By the way, quick question for you, big guy. I'm very little. What kind of present do you think would make Miss Ivy at East Wind happy? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, Manny. Uh. Off to work. I need to find people with no fashion sense. Blizzard. Sorry. Okay. Killed itself. Um. Ooh, tomatoes. Oh, yeah. I should have figured. Okay. Are you... You've got a mushroom hat. You're not very fashionable. I'm in a hurry. Okay. Oh, it's okay, Esther. You're family. Used by my Hylian tomatoes. They're my prize crop. Put a lot of love into growing those. Whoop. Everything froze for a second. In season now, so help yourself to a few down at the general store. Oh, it's lagging again. I gotta fix it. La, la, la. Okay. What the hell, dude? You know what? We can come back to this. I was here for rice. I should buy the rice. Probably in the general store. Whoops. Okay. Dodged. Let's just get the rice. Go right in. Dude, freaking say no more. Rice. Rice. Yeah. Rice, rice, uh. rice. Bob, fresh milk. Oh. Oh. I want rice. Oh shit. Rice. Oh. Need twenty. There's only five. Oh. Oh. Damn, dude. <laughs> Need 20. It's my first five rices. I guess I just gotta hang in there until he restocks. Can I sell some goodies? Can I sell a ruby? You know what? Sell both of them. Sell both of them. F it, right? Okay. Anything else? Nope. Never has been. I gotta unplug my headset. The cord keeps disturbing me. There we go. God, I'm so hungry all of a sudden. Wow, five dollars. Thank you, Alec. It's cold. Took your advice from the Minecraft stream. I got a blanket. Still cold. 
Whoops. Get a second blanket. Stack them. You're not fashionable. You're old and weird. Ah. Shall we retire? You visitor here? Tourist? Those known for living off the land. Till the soil, let nature, whatever. Now that everything's getting so glitzy as some folks try to drum up more tourism business. Mind you, we were all happy to see CZ return the, to the village after she'd been away for so long. Some folks, without her prima, started wearing that flashy CC brand stuff right away in celebration. But it's a tad over the top for me and my son-in-law, Warden. We prefer the simple life, the way we've always lived it. If I don't mean to talk your ear off. You seem well-adjusted. I like you. By all means, go on and have yourself a peaceful stay here. Have a mushroom. Say this. This is from CC. Thank you kindly. Us old folks don't know much about what's in now, you know. Happy to vote for whoever for mayor if they fix up the village real nice. I don't want to necessarily campaign for CZ. Yeah. Got mushroom hat. You're just like a child, so whatever. I don't think you can vote. Um, hello, old folks, fashionless folks, Wharton specifically. There we go. Who's this freak? I'm sorry. What brings you to town? Oh, he's actually pretty handsome now that I get a good look. Dude, everyone in this village cannot get enough of, of me. I'm trying to get a village. Uh, uh, angle my face but I can't do it look at me with my hands on my hips I look confident as hell I have a good idea you should take this and not ask any questions okay so we have my feet so fast I give me my prized eggs okay just forget what happened here today okay it's forgotten whoops I hit the wrong thing easily given easy to break This isn't working. <laughs> I was wondering whether it was possible to romanticize eggs. In the end, eggs are something you cook and eat for breakfast, and that's it. Shut back to work. Mushroom. Owned. 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 Food. Fashion. Whatever. This is long ago that doing stuff like that was completely unheard of here. Farm families don't know what to make of it either. Can you blame them? Anybody here want a mushroom? No. Okay. Anybody else? In a shrooming mood? Are you the person I already hit earlier with a, with a shroom? Or are you a different old wandering person? You are different. Shh. Mushroom. Okay, there's a well, dude, yeah, wow, oh. pretty fish, anything else in here, ooh, bad. A bomb flower. Thank you. Another pretty fish. Okay, all done. Yippee. Any more... Mushroom me people. Oh, do you have a mushroom? Hold on. Stop. You're fast. Stop it. You're fast, but I'm faster. You're fast, but I'm faster. I'm a traveler. Okay. Well, I'm faster. Um, 
We've only given out, what, three mushrooms? Damn, dude. Still five people out there that I have not found yet. Did I talk to you? Yes. Mushroom. Nothing in here. Nothing in here. This is a nice house y'all got. A lot of rooms. Oh my god, you have like eight beds in here. Oh, you don't have mushrooms. Amazing. It's Wharton, yeah! Mushroom, dude. They're all the rage. We need four more. Let's go this way. We're closing in. Okay, bye. Oh, that's cute. This one's cute. This is a cute little house. This is a solo shack. There's some goodies over there. I like this house. Okay. Anyone? Mushroom. Damn it! Damn it! Ugh! 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 Where are you bastards? I can see you up there. You have a freaking mushroom on your head. Rice. Oh my god. Where did I get that from? Is there any more? Nuts. Oh. Okay. I thought it would let me go into the... That's fine. I don't even care. Damn it. Rice. Rice or people without mushroom head. Are you the same freaking... Maybe they're identical twins. Okay. You got rice from cutting grass. Oh. Dude. Smart. Ah. Oh. Holy S... Grass cutting machine, I'm like a lawnmower. Boom. I'm gathering rice. This is my style. Two rices. Two for the rice of one. Another rice. Holy frick. I'm a machine. I'm unconscious. Oh, I forgot I was supposed to follow... Shit. I, I'm supposed to follow whatever her name is. CC. At night. Damn it, I missed my chance. Where's... Where's... She's over here. CC, CC, CC. Oh, shit. Oh, damn it. Oh, I forgot. There she goes. We're totally chill. I'm just going this way. 
Well, you sh can't be saying that shit out loud. How you doing? How you doing? How goes it? Oh. Okay, so I do have to be secretive. I was wondering why it would let me just kind of... So is she like done for the night or is she going to come back out and try again? Okay, we're good. So I just have to be very sneaky. Watch her from a distance. This is good. I have my mirror shield as well. Get some rice. Don't turn around. Oh, you sneak. You sneak. You're such a sneak. She, where did she go? Dude, she freaking vanished. What the hell? She's gone. What? I had eyes on her the whole time. Oh, there goes the lizard. Well, damn, dude. Did she fall in the river and drown? Alone at last. I gotta get inside. Oh, I could have done a send. That's fine. Okay. Sneaky. Ah, oh. perfect. I did believe nobody saw me. For you to enjoy another of my late night meals in secret. Ah, how I enjoy my nightly vegetables. The shine, the luster, the fragrance. Yes, indeed. Now this is luxury dining. And so, without further ado, let us tuck in. Crunch, munch, crunch. Like a, like a rabbit. Thanks to the farmer's deft touch and the quality of the soil, I can even eat the skin without misgivings. Honestly, vegetables from anywhere but Hatano Village simply don't count. They're nowhere near as filling. Though I've built a reputation on flash and glamour here in private, I must admit the simple, unadorned things are best. Damn. Now that I'm full for tonight, it's... Oh, wow. She is a faker. She's a faker. Can I have some? Yeah, I'm sure no one will worry if I just... Yeah, okay. I saw you. I learned everything. I learned everything. Everything. Oh my god. That's her terrible secret is that she likes to eat a carrot. Silo across the way. Oh my god. I thought she'd be like, like big. Is that really all there was to it? Ha! Huh. I know my sister says a lot about charisma and style and has to do everything in the most ostentatious way possible. Between you and me, her tastes are pretty plain. She loves the slow life here in Atena Village. She probably told you she came back here because of development or whatever. The truth is, she just wanted to eat the vegetables growing right here in her hometown again. <laughs> At least I'm pretty sure that's the case. Either way, I'm so glad she wasn't up to anything scandalous. I want you to have this in exchange for helping me out. Oh my god, that's awesome. Sister really is a handful sometimes. I agree. You understand why the two of them don't just work together instead of going to such bizarre lengths. I wonder what Cece has to say about this. You love carrots! Uh -huh. Do we forget our mission? I saw you eating carrots. Oh. Uh -huh. 
Uh, who are Reed's voters? Let's work in the pasture here. Care a little for fashion. Okay. Taking a walk up the hill to the lab each and every morning. I think I already got him. Okay, we already hit the dude who goes for a walk. Yeah. Is that a mushroom or is that just a farmer hat? It's a farmer hat. It's a mushroom. Oh. Ah. Boom. You have a mushroom. You have a mushroom. You do not. Are you the one from before? Yes. Ah. Okay. Um, we're closing in. What do we need? Three more now? I see find people work in the pastures, but I feel like I searched the pastures. I'm not suspicious. Our vegetables are the best around. Oh. Shut up, Tebow. <laughs> Sorry, Tebow. You seem cool. Uh, oop, I fell. Oh, I fell down. No worries. Let me up. Pretty please. Okay. I don't know why. I just really felt like doing this. Okay. Two points. Um, Any more m people in need of shroomage? Anybody really just hurting for a shroom? Oh my god, what the hell is this? Is it like a playground? Do you run a daycare or something? Yeah. It's a school teacher. Hi. It's Simon. Oh, it's you, Link. I haven't seen you in- Link, you're back? Ah, my apologies for the outburst. Clearly you're back in town then. But what of Princess Zelda? We don't freaking know, Simon. Ah, Princess Zelda's still missing, which is the reason you came here alone. That makes more sense. Princess Zelda built this school, you see. She cared so much about the children. I'm sure this would have been her first stop if she had returned. And, yeah. Uh, focusing on Hyrule's history alongside the Calamity. You know, Link, you're welcome to sit in on a lesson if you'd like. That's cute. I, I want to. That's it? Okay. Do you want mushroom? Epic. Toodle Town. Okay, um. Any farmers bow by the pastures? Little plants. And a playground as well. How nice. Okay, uh, I see some goats. Do you guys want a mushroom? Do you want a mushroom? Do you want a mushroom? Okay. Um. Ducks. Okay. I. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hello. Maybe up by the the Juan Mills. I feel like I already checked the Juan Mills though. Let's still go up there. Is there something on there? It was just stone. I thought it was a giant spider. Okay, well. I don't know. I've already been here, lizard. I think I already checked this house. Damn, dude. This is tough. There's still three people, right? Three. Not one, not two. Three. We only have an hour left in the stream.
What the Krug? Ugh. What the skies? Pretty. Okay. I am displeased. Mushroom. Oh, it's Clavia. From when they were talking about whether to go through the mayor election or not. It's going to give a hassle. They're both so stubborn. We should clear the air between them and this silly quarrel once and for all. That's a moot point now. There's something else in my mind. I have to take care of this before mayor. What's on your mind? Ma. You mind letting me in here? I won't mince words, but my husband, Reed, that man of mine, he shuts himself up in our shed every night. I don't have the faintest what he's up to. Probably dressing up with pretty uh. clothes. When I ask, he says, it's a secret. I'm, I'll snoop. I'll snoop. I'll snoop. I'll snoop. I'll snoop. I'll snoop. If you don't, you never fit through a window. Maybe you could dig a hole, dude. <laughs> you have no idea. I can get down there. Okay, I'm lost. I don't know how to do it. <laughs> okay, there's got to be like the the well system probably runs underneath. Oh wait, Uma. Oh wait, I already talked to you. Shit. Shit. Okay, it's uh, right here. This is the shed. <laughs> Boom. It's Reed's diary. I firmly believe that Hatano Village's charm is in the delicious vegetables and milk from our farms. There's no denying that these things just aren't resonating with the youth nowadays. I've got no business being mayor if I can't fix that. So I got together with Knack, the best farmer in these parts, we came up with a new type of pumpkin. The color, shape, and appearance are based on the CC brand aesthetic, which is popular with the young folk. If it is snagged, though, it might be a bit before we achieve our goal of shipping the pumpkins out. Hmm. Pumpkin. Pumpkins. You say he's developing a new type of pumpkin? So that's why he's been consulting with Knack so often. Could have just asked Cece about it directly, but I know he's too hardworking and stubborn ah. for that. It's a relief to find out the truth. Ah. Ah. Thank you for looking into this for me. I get a reward. Tomatoes. Mm. Ten tomatoes. Ten tomatoes. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Done with these two, so I guess now we just need to work on finding three more people to give. Okay. Dick. Give some ush rooms. Who are you? Are you Reed? Dr Druther. I lost my head a little over there. I'm not too proud of the way I behaved. Don't you worry about me. I have a couple tricks up my sleeve against Cece. Might not be able to pull one of them off in time for the mayoral election. Focusing on the second plan. To bring back a taste no one's tried here in years. What kind of taste? My grandfather worked with someone from the village to create a special kind of food. It's too of its time to catch on, so it never went further than the first trial run, but I never forgot it. Even today, I can still recall the gooey mouthfeel of the one bite my grandfather shared with me. I always wanted to make it a signature staple of this village. If I could accomplish that, then I'd have something that I could stand up to Cece. Except I can't remember who in the village my grandfather worked with or what they created. Pungent. If I could just smell that aroma again, it might jog my memory. Hmm. Tried the fresh milk they make on the farm up the hill. Okay. 
creamy, melty mouthfeel. And unique, pungent aroma. I think smelling that aroma again might jog his memory. I'd like to leave, please. Okay. Well, let's go get our milk. I suppose. Said the farm atop the hill have good milk. So I guess we're going there. Where's the school schoolhouse? Huh. All done with the rain. How much rice do I have? 13. Good for me. Okay. Well, I only need seven more. Cricket. Okay. We're getting distracted. Farm on top of the hill. Some, some milk, milk, milk. Pungent aroma. Or whatever. Smooth, creamy, melty mouth feel. Yippee. Multitasking. There's a farm. And a dragon. You have a mushroom hat. Y'all both have mushroom hats. Damn. This is good though. I don't know if we've been up here. Mushroom. Shit, dude. Y'all are all... It froze again. I gotta close and reopen. A rump. Okay. What up, dude? Dance. Look at the pasture. Uh, cows. Mushroom. There we go. That's that's only two left. This is from CC. Isn't that sweet? These are tasty. If you fry them up as a snack. Don't get me wrong. I appreciate the gift. Me, and my daughter, Koyan, and old man talk. Don't care much about clothes. I use his fashion in the field, right? So I'm glad that's all you came for. Tell me you're here to pick up some fresh milk. I've been in a tight spot. Fresh milk? Tell me you haven't heard of my farm's fresh milk. It's the best in the Dano. Secrets the special feed I make for my cows. Gives their milk an extra little something you don't get anywhere else. Because I've been having trouble getting my hands across acorns. Dude, I have so many. I have so many. I have so many. At least three acorns. Dude, here's some acorns. So many freaking acorns. Fresh milk. Okay. If you ever want more fresh milk, it's probably something for three acorns. Okay. We did another mushroom as well. Puppies. Puppies, sheeps, and, and, and cows, and bulls, and whatever. Mushroom. How do I fix this? We dive into the pond. There's no way. It's too deep to swim. Huh? What is that blank stare? Oh, you must be a customer. Uh, I have a Hylian shroom. There's one more. There's one more. Message bottle. Dude. I will do that for you. Okay. Whoa, dragon. Alright, I need to make a little boat. Not even. I really just need a platform to stand on. Oh. I guess it's a village. I guess you can't do it in village. Startle. Drop your... Okay. Uh, I guess I'll just cut a tree down. close enough. I 
and they're not gonna let me take this out. Oh, never mind. Oh. I didn't think that through. Okay, well. No more mine. Oh, right. This is the freaking spot for rice, I guess. Uh, okay. Well, in that case. So I can take out a, a device. It was just that I wasn't on level enough plane. Yeah. I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I thought that would work. There you go. There you are. Did it. I'm too busy to. Huh? Boom. Pick a creep, creep, crumb, promise, message bottle. How did you. Got it. Did you fish it out for me? Thanks. There should be a letter in this bottle with advice for getting our farm back on its feet. Maybe it has a recipe or whatever. Gosh, from his great grandpa's handwriting. Penmanship was so messy that no one but him and his family could read it. Oh, I hadn't thought of that. New specialty with mare, cheese, fermentation. Can't name. Too early. Yeah, this could work. Try to run, but I want to put. Uh, yeah. Okay. Hey. I'll I'll come by, right now. <laughs> cheese, something cheese, fermentation. You already got one of my shrooms, so. Are all three of you shroomed up? Yeah. Okay. Um, I would like to learn how to cook the fermented cheese or whatever. Where are you? Okay. Could you show it up? Take a look at this. Cheese. I call it. Hatay no cheese. That message my grand grandpa left behind had the recipe. It's springy on the outside, but melty on the inside and so delicious. You'll think you're dreaming. Cheese. Back to the reason I called you here. It's, well, you know. Couldn't made it so you, so why did you be the first time? So. Anyway, consider my thanks. Go on. Hatay no cheese. Oh, it's like brie. Cheese made from Hatay cow milk. Hatay cow's milk. Into a warm dish and enjoy its rich flavor and melty texture. Yeah. Oh my god. Cheese. So ahead of its time. The villagers rejected it. Having eaten this, I think they were nuts. Now is the time for Tano cheese to make a splash in the culinary world. Sick of fashion getting all the attention lately. It's really eating into our business. Ah. If anything will bring the customers in, it's this. I'd say it's time to do some renovation around here. Just gonna put cheese themed decorations up. Everywhere it's... Make it a cheese house? Dude, totally. <laughs> Ta-da! The Hitano Cheese Shop is complete. What do you think? Next up is to get those folks over at the general store to start stocking it. That reminds me, you won't get this offer anywhere else, but around here I'll give you some for fresh milk instead of rupees. Ah. Make the dream my great-grandpa <laughs> You can visit me again, right? Maybe. Ta-ta. Oops. Ooh. Ah! Tomatoes. If you do tomatoes, cheese, and, and wheat, you can make a pizza pie. Mmm. Yummy. Maybe that, I, I can't tell if that's the recipe he wants or if it's just the cheese. I'm going to go show him the cheese, though, and he can give it a sniff, and he can be like, make pizza. Rice. How many rice do we have now? 17. Is that more rice? 18. Oh, my God. Two more rice. Two more rices. One more rice. Wow. Boom. 
boom. We've officially collected all the rice and one extra that we need. Sword. Okay. Today ended up being zero story progression, but I had a great time. We've just been, like, doing all the little city tasks. City boy! Cheese. Smell it. Sniff, sniff. Yeah, smell the cheese, dude. Smell the cheese. A certain unique. Certain. Am I smelling things? Or do I just take a certain unique pungent aroma? Have some cheese. This is it. This is just what I've been looking for. My grandfather developed it with a fellow villager. Potato cheese. Of course. Makes sense that my grandfather would have been working with someone from the farm up there. It's a miracle that Koyan not, not only found the recipe, but managed to reproduce it. <laughs> this is great news. It's a clear sign that we ought to make potato cheese a new village staple. Ah, swing the election for me. Let me pay you for that cheese. Oh my god, thank you. Believe me, it's worth every rupee. Now then, I should get in touch with Koyan. So we can start preparing mass production. I'll ask the Hatena Village General Store and some traveling merchants to add it to their wares, too. Shouldn't take much more than that to tip the election my way. Just come out and watch it happen. Okay, well, I still need to give one person a mushroom or whatever. Okay, we've done all those. Now I just need to find one person to give a mushroom, and then we can go give... Bryson or whatever his rice Benson or his name give him his rice Okay, where could this last person be is it you oh my god is it you oh No, I've already talked to you damn it I mean, I'll check just to be safe, but okay, whatever Going up <laughs> Okay, could have done it for a second there I don't care. I think I already talked to that person. Um, this is going to be brutal. Looking for this last freaking person. Ugh. Okay. Um, I already checked all these houses, dude. Well, maybe, oh, it's evening. Maybe they were at home and now they are. Nope. No dice. Is there anything more at, like, past that farm? Because we kind of just got the cheese and then gave up. I'm so freaking hungry. I have no idea how hungry I am right now. Okay. Going up. Boom. Let's see. I went that way to the farm. What if I just keep climbing? So tired. Me too. Just kidding. Look at me sprinting past all of you. Oh, there we go. Do you want a mushroom? She's from Cece? Well, that's generous of her. Thanks. What's this? That's a fine looking mushroom you brought me. Seems like lately Cece's mushrooms are popping up everywhere around here. Makes my eyes water, but to see those flashy colors wherever I turn. Family and all my friends my age tend to take life slower than she does. Still in all, it'd be rude to turn out a generous gift. Thank you. Done! I gotta report back to Quee Quee or whatever. Then she can be like, you freaking did it. Have money. And if she gives me anything else, I'm going to throw a fit. I'm going to start screaming and crying. I'm going to drop to the floor. And I'm going to pound my fist against the hardwood. Until she gives me a hundred dollars. Quee quee. I passed out your, your shit. Done. Bring on the election. Have you handed them out already? Yep. Oh, we delivered all my little gifts, I see. Well done. That ought to help a few of those Reed voters see the light. Here you are, sign of my gratitude. It's a rare mushroom worth more than most can afford. Okay, I don't like you very much at all. I really just don't. I like your style, but I don't like you as a person. As you're on Team CC, I expect you to eat it and fire yourself up for the barrel election coming up. Ugh. I'm good. I believe I remember Sophie saying not long ago that the preparations for the mayoral election were complete. So your timing is excellent. Speak to Sophie about the next steps. Done. 
Everything's ready. It's time to get the election started. Try again during the daytime on a sunny day. Whatever. Oh, well, it's raining, so I can't make a fire to go sleepies. Fire? Can I sleep? Can I use this bed? You look so comfortable, dude. Wow, look at all his mushroom-themed decor. I guess you don't have a fire in here. Uh, there's an inn up the way. Okay, cool, cool. I like the mushrooms. I like your style. Uh, but CC as a person, does not have my vote. She's prissy, and I don't like her. Reed is, like, a dick, but he kind of, he, like, backtracked and apologized. And CC just kind of, like, doubled down. I don't know. I don't like either of them. Uh, fire? Or do I have to talk to you or whatever? Oh, here we go. One bed, please. Bedtime. Bedtime, please. Oh, bedtime. 20 rupees, please. Regular bed. Uh, just until morning. Sleepy time. Amazing. Ah. Sunny. Oh, it's cloudy. Well, it will be sunny eventually. So we just need to hang in there. I can start a fire and sleep until noon. Uh, there we go. Sleepies. Good morning. It's cloudy again. God, this is so annoying. Can't we just do it? Oh, okay. It's fine. Oh, boy. And now, without further ado... Let's have each of our candidates for mayor say a few words. Um, uh, hi, I'm Reed. I, I believe that the heart of our village is its pastoral culture. We've built a close-knit, self-sufficient lifestyle here in Ateno, and I don't want to see us lose that. My plan is to strengthen our community with new local specialties, starting with our brand new Ateno cheese. I am the world-renowned CC, Hyrule's premier fashion designer, but you all knew that, of course. Together, we can turn this backwater village into Hyrule's go-to destination for all things stylish. Vegetables don't make the world go round. It's glamour that rakes in the cash. And nobody knows glamour like me, darlings. Boo. Oh, damn. Fashion comes and goes. Your style's trendy now, but it'll be over soon, and then where will we be? Nonsense. It's trends that shape the world, not the other way around. That's... That's an F! Sophie. Uh -huh. Oh, she's done. Both of you are just arguing for more of what you like. Now it's best for Hateno. You can't fool me, Cece. You've loved simple, plain things forever, including the vegetables of Hateno Village. And over a fact that you hide in the silo at night to snack on vegetables. <laughs> Moi? Wherever did you get such a curious notion? Uh. I am really... Really just savoring Cece's downfall right now. So much. And you, Reed, your secret's out too. I know why you've been secretly studying Cece's designs in the shed. I think there's something there you can use to get the youth to care about vegetable farming. Mm. Now who went and told you that? Mm. Cece, I can't deny any of it. Uh. I should have. It should have made me happy that you came and livened up the village. Uh. No, Reed, it is I who should be ashamed. My childish pride would not allow me to admit the truth. 
Sophie is, is the one that I feel like everyone can get behind here. The trends and style I made my name on are built on the foundation of traditional culture that our forebears worked for. Please forgive me, everyone. I'm sorry, too. Sophie, I hereby withdraw my candidacy. Can I be mayor? Can Sophie be mayor? I'd be a fool to pretend you're not the reason our village is flourishing. I don't want to deny you your due. Did I hear that you're working on new vegetables to attract the youth of today? It sounds like a CC worthy endeavor. <laughs> Sophie should be mayor. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing wrong with asking if you can help, you know. People of Hateno, we've come to a decision. Best way to keep Hateno Village vibrant is to work together to combine traditional culture with new ideas. Okay. Who's mayor? Yeah. Yeah, I fixed it. I fixed it. Oh, can I get the hat? Okay, whatever. Let's let's go say hello. In we go. Give me your hat. I knew, of course, that you'd been in cahoots with Sophie, but I never dreamed you'd always been conspiring with Clavia. Still in all, we can call that election a success. Do you remember what we discussed when you first came here? This CC hat is the latest masterpiece from the CC collection. See those luxurious curves, the avant-garde colorway. Everything about the hat is perfect, so I've been saving it to bequeath the perfect model. Do you grasp yet what I'm getting at? It's you that I want to model my CC hat. You who saved not just Atena Village, but also me and Reed. My perfect hat is unsuitable for anyone else to wear. And besides, it's... Oh. Uh, let's not pretend it won't look absolutely dashing on you. It's true. Ooh. Here we are. Wish you could get a weirdly bouncy mush hat instead of this disaster. <laughs> now put on that CC hat and lord it over the whole world. Tidy, hmm? I shall reinvent myself and open Ventus clothing anew. Sophie, there's work to be done, sister. Can I buy armor or something? Please? Oh, sick. As for myself, I've had a long think about where to take my brand from here. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. See me if you have a part ways with precious apparel that's too rare to be purchased. Epic, okay. Um, I already have all the Hylian stuff. This is Hylian tunic, Hylian trousers, Hylian hood, and the Royal Guard uniform. That's pretty cool. So I'm, I'm mighty pricey, so I'm I'm good for now. But I'm a I'm a fan of the of the design. It looks rad. Okay. Well, uh, does that mean I'm done with this task? Yeah. All done. Well, let's go deliver our rice. Oh, I died. We got a lot done. Here in Hateno Village. We entered and we made this village our village. I am Hateno Village. I am Hateno Village. I got your rice. Got y'all juice. Okay, where is he? I always forget. He's somewhere on the beach. He's like over here. There you are. Sure is coming down. You know what's coming down? Rice, bitch. Here's your Hylian rice. Blah, 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 blah. Wow, he really did get to work fast, didn't he? Uh-oh. There's no loading symbol or anything. Okay, there we go. He loves to build. Okie do. Sorry for the wait. <laughs> hmm. Foundations are nice and solid. Now it's time to move on to repairing the buildings. Okay. 
Five buildings need fixing. Three of them are establishments, the inn, the restaurant, and the lucky treasure shop. Two of them are homes. The village, head the village head's house and Armis's house. Repair process will depend on the building we're working on. Okay. Uh, which building should we get to work on? An establishment, please. Uh, the lucky treasure shop. Yes, we are. Ah. The lucky treasure shop is over there. It's a charming spot that beguiles travelers with a treasure game that rumor has that no one ever loses. Mm. Have we had the lucky treasure shop? You can that time. Oh, oh, keep oh, do. I like this dude. I dig his style. Oh. Bolson. All right, here we are. It looks good. Mm. Once upon a time, a palm tree grew up through the building's second story roof. Used to be a bit of a landmark because of that. Now, well, the damage is worse than I thought. There has to be a central pillar. It's crucial support for the building. I already used the logs you got to destroy the foundation. Oh. Look at that house over there. What I'm thinking is we'll use a log from a palm tree as a central pillar for the lucky treasure shop too. This building is big, so rather than connect the roof and floor, palm tree log would go in the plant pot on the second floor and through the hole in the roof. Oh. Okay. Uh, with ultra hand, you dunce. Okay, let's not do that. Palm fruit. You've heard of the kingdom being the house that Griffy built. But have you heard of Lurland Village being the village that Thermi built? I think this is straight enough on the bottom for it to work. Okay, I need to grab it from a... Perfect. Awesome. I need to grab it from a lower point so I can, like, put it up. Okay, thanks. Uh, can I... Okay, I still can't quite get it high enough, so I need to put her down. And then grab it at the very end. Oh, it doesn't allow it. Perfect. Okay. Well, then in the meantime, let's just stick it in there for now. And then get up to here. There we go. Oof, we're running out of time there. Ta da! It's perfect! Couldn't have found a better pillar to hold this place up myself. See the rest of me. I'm on it. Okay. <laughs> Bolson, da da da, Bolson. Hua! Hua! Bolson, da da da, Bolson. Sha 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 ding! Okay, Bolson. Oh. He loves to build houses, it's his favorite. Okie do. All done. Wow, you're good at this. Oh my god, you're so good at this. What the hell? It's perfecto! Wow, it's the biggest building in this village. Oh my god, I'm so pumped. I was sure the monsters had done my shop in. I heard the pirates were gone and came running. I can't believe I could open my shop again. Never thought this day would come. But this means everything to me. My old man, rest his soul, left it to me. Please, have this. Oh, dude, sick. Picked several of them while I was hiding out. I was planning to throw them at the pirates, but there's nothing for that now. Because of you, the lucky treasure shop is back in business. <laughs> you don't even need rupees. You can be broke and still come on in and try your luck. Doors are open starting now. I'm going. I want to go. Oh. oh, sorry. Look, you and me, we are beasts of construction. It's true. I'm going to go test my luck. Ah. Monster bits in cages. They're not going to attack you, dude. 
You're him, aren't you? The key just sent the pirates packing. Get to rebuilt the village, including this humble establishment. I'd given up, you know. Glad you proved me wrong. Uh, uh. Crack one open. Dude, consider it done. Boom. I got a prize. Let me see it. Red. So that means you get the prize on the right. Lucky Ooh. man. You must be pretty happy scoring that prize for free. If they get delivered to your place of residence, too bad. I don't do that. Oop, also I'll take that rupee back. It's not for you to keep. <laughs> so that's the game. Pick a chest, win a prize. All upside. There is one catch. I have to catch.